My name is Rucha. I'm from Cherry Hill, New Jersey, and I work in finance. My name is Amit. I'm from Islin. I'm a DJ and also a VP of an IT staffing firm. I met Rucha at a party that I was DJing, actually a wedding, and uh, she was a family member of the person who was getting married. The point that I knew that Rucha was for me is when I was actually in the hospital and she was there with me by every waking moment. Ami proposed to me in September of 2016 at a trip to Aruba. We're getting married in the spring and we're getting married at the Hyatt Regency in New Brunswick. I'm here today with my fiance, and she's here to buy her outfit for the wedding ceremony. Hi, welcome Hi. to Najana. My name is Shia. I'm Rucha. Nice to meet you, Rucha. Amit. Nice to meet you, Amit. So, getting married? Yes. Okay, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. What are you guys looking for? So, we're here to see wedding langos for myself. Perfect. This is for the actual ceremony? Yes. And is this a traditional Hindu ceremony? Yes, it yep. is. I really like florals, so I would like to have a lot of flowers or flower prints in my design. Um, okay. I would also want something with like multicolored embroidery. Okay, so we'll look at a few different options and see, and is there a budget that we're working with? No, nope, no. no budget. No budget? Okay. We decided to come to Nazrana because Amit's family is local in the area, and they've always spoke about the store and um, recommendations from other people, so we decided to try. I'm definitely focusing on the floral and the multicolor embroidery but I picked different colors. Okay. It's an elongated pattern, so it'll definitely make you look taller. What do you think? I do like the colors. I like the, um, the different patterns and the different textures and all of that. What do you think? It's nice. Uh, not too crazy about it, um, but it's nice. Okay, well, let's try it. You never know. Sometimes things look better on. The second one that I picked, it's all red with the floral embroidery and the multicolors in it. Wow. I really like this one. Yeah? I love the color. What do you think of it? It's nice. Okay. I would like you to try the neutral and the red and see where we go. Okay. So what do you think? I really like the pattern and the embroidery. Um, I'm really loving the long sleeves. The long sleeves? I don't think the color is really suiting me well. Okay. I just feel a little washed out. Okay. Um, so I think maybe trying something a little bit more darker Vibrant. or richer. Yeah. What do you think of it? Nothing spectacular, but it's okay. Okay. Well, let's try the red one. See what we think about the red one. Okay. I love this dress, it's amazing. This is definitely the dress for Rucha, and I really think that she should get this dress. So Rucha, what do you think of this one? I love this dress, I love it. I love the embroidery, I love the color. This is exactly what I wanted, it's perfect. The blouse is actually very flattering. The sweetheart cut is beautiful. I really like the style and design of this. I think this is it, this is the dress. I mean, what do you think? I love it, literally it's the Perfect dress. Yeah. I love everything about it. It's it's perfect. This yeah. is definitely the one. I think this is definitely the one, but that means you're going to have to change your outfit. Why? I love my outfit. Yeah, but if I wear red and you're wearing mint, we're going to look like a Christmas tree. And I love Christmas. This is, I mean, this is what I wanted. Well, I'm the bride. I think I should get to wear what I want more than you. So I like this dress. I'm not changing my outfit. I mean, you said you would change your outfit. You have to change your outfit. You can have the dress. I'm gonna keep my outfit. I'm, my family and everybody loves my outfit. I'm not changing it. I don't wanna be like the cookie cutter bride and groom that have a red and tan outfit. I don't wanna do that. Why did you go in the first place without me by yourself to get an outfit? Now I have to just go with whatever that is? No, you should have waited for me or we should have gone together. After seeing you in this and after seeing me in my outfit, we both look good. I think everything is going to work out, but I'm not changing my outfit. No, it's not this working. is definitely not going to go with your outfit. 
at all. I think there's something missing. So you already have your outfit. Yep. Your Bought wedding ceremony outfit. Everything. I bought my custom shoes, my dupatta. Here. Here. Okay. I wish I knew that. Um, and it's mint. It's a green. Yeah. Yep. Looks really good. I'm sure it does. But now think about it. You're in all mint. She's in red with peach accents and blush accents. That's not going to look good together. Visually, yeah, you may love it. She may love these individually, but together, it's not going to look coordinated. And that's all I wanted for our outfits was just to be coordinated to look together. Rucha is not seeing the big picture in this. Um, this is definitely something that can make it, we can make this work and it'll look really good. I disagree with Amit's opinion here because the red outfit does not match his mint shirvani. Not in terms of complementary colors, not in terms of embroidery. They're totally different. Do you have a picture of your outfit? Or yeah. do you have a design number that I can see which one it is? Yeah, I can look it up for you. Okay. As much as you love that, um, let me take a look at his and then maybe we can look at something like this, but in better colors. Okay. Shanta, can you help her change? I'm just gonna go take a look at his outfit. I'm so upset that I can't get this outfit. I've dealt with situations worse than this. This is just, the groom has his outfit, no big deal. The good thing is he loves it. Oh, I know this one. Okay, it's the mint with all the sequin embroidery. Did you get your accessories also? Yes, exactly. Yep, I got a what pearl color? necklace. Okay. Um, and also a dark green dupatta, forest green, I'd say. Okay, so we'll work off of that and get something that goes with that. Um, Ruja, I know you're a little upset right now. Don't let that bother you because I looked at Amit Shravani. We have tons of beautiful outfits that will be bridal but complimentary to his. Okay. So stay with me, take a look. Okay. He mentioned he has a pearl necklace. So I picked this because it has pearls with the multicolor flowers in it. I really love the work and I love the embroidery and the flower theme. The color though, I don't know. I just never pictured a bride to be wearing green. It's perfect. It matches my outfit. Everything looks beautiful about this. You're gonna look beautiful in this. Now I'm starting to feel like I'm matching my outfit to your outfit when it should really be the other way around. What can we do? I bought my outfit. I'm not changing it. This is a really beautiful outfit. I think it would be a little bit difficult to match to his outfit because his outfit's mint green um, and I'm looking more towards pinks and reds and maroons and more traditional colors. The second one that I picked, it's ivory. It's raw silk. I know with Gujarati traditions, Banitar Lengas have whites and reds. So it kind of has that floral theme, but a traditional look. So let's see if you like that. Wow. I really like the work on this one. It's not the typical color that I was thinking of when I first walked in, um, but we can try. Yeah? What do you think of it? I really like it. It's got best of both worlds. It even, it even matches my outfit like that as well. Okay, we can try it. I was leaning more towards the pinks and the reds and the traditional colors, but after putting on this dress and seeing me in it, I love this dress. What do you think of it? I love everything about it. Do I look like a bride? You look like my bride. <laughs> <laughs> but is this a 10 out of a 10? This is more than a 10 out of 10. That's all I wanted to hear. Sarucha, are you ready to be an Azrana bride? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, well, it's beautiful. Congratulations, I'm gonna give you a hug. Thank you. Sorry, I couldn't let you pick the red dress, but you got a much better one now. <laughs> Thank you. This is the most perfect and beautiful dress I've ever seen. She definitely looks like my bride in this dress, and 1,000%, there's no doubt about it, this is the one. I absolutely love the dress. It's definitely what I want. Weddings and relationships are about compromise, so I'm really happy she was able to compromise and, and find something to our, both of our liking. If I had known that Amit already has a mint Shravani, I would never bring out a red outfit that ultimately Rucha loved, and it just made everything very uncomfortable. Um, we could have just avoided that entire situation 
and just started with complimentary outfits to Amit Shivani. But I'm very, very happy for her and Amit because they're gonna get their unique modern wedding now. My name is Deb. I'm a population health analyst in, at Mount Sinai in New York City, and I'm originally from Alabama. My name is Neil. Um, I work at NYU Langone Medical Center. I'm a biomedical engineer there. I grew up around New Jersey. I've been here my whole life. I love it here. I met Neil on Coffee Meets Bagel. Um, he was the third guy that messaged me, but the only guy that I actually met. I think I knew she was the one for me when I first met her uh, on our first date. We're getting married on the beach. Um, so our theme is kind of the casualness of the beach, but with some added elegance with our florals, which are lilac and blush. We're getting married December in Clearwater Beach, Florida. Welcome to Nizrana. My name is Shia. Who is the bride? I'm the bride. Oh, hi, Shia. Nice, nice to, to meet you. you. What is your name? Deb. Deb? Mm -hmm. Neil. I'm guessing you're the groom, Neil. Yes. Okay. Isabel. Isabel. And are you bridesmaid? Bridesmaid. Oh, perfect. Bridesmaid. Okay, cool. What brings you here today? My mother in law had actually bought me an outfit, um, okay. but we're getting married on the beach, and the outfit is cream. So I wanted to find something that's traditionally red, okay, um, but also is simple and in the same style as the outfit my mother-in-law had picked. In the me. same style, mm -hmm. okay. And is there a budget? My budget is around 1500. I'm okay with Deb buying another dress for the wedding, um, especially when my mother already purchased one for her, only because I want Deb to be happy. I, at the same time, had her same skepticism because she knew she was going to have a beach wedding, and this beautiful dress um, was cream colored. So not exactly a fitting dress for the beach. If my mother doesn't like the dress, unfortunately, she's just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, mom. I don't think Neil wants to buy another dress for the wedding, but I think that he wants to see me happy. I picked out three outfits. They're all red, all silk. Just give me feedback. Okay. I think it's great for a destination beach wedding. I love it. It's beautiful. I love the simplicity of the design. I love the color. And I love that it's not too blingy. So, um, what do you guys think? I like it. It's very nice. The floral pa patterns are really nice, too. Okay, so we'll put that in the try-on pile. Great. Okay. Yeah. So let's the second one, also red, also silk, but the patterning's very different. So let's look at that one, too. Oh, wow. So it has multicolor embroidery in it. It's nice, but I feel like it might be a little too loud. <laughs> too much? Too much going on? Yeah. Do you want to give it a shot? Try it on and see? You never yeah, know? I'll try it on. OK. The third one that I picked is a darker red. See, I just want to see how the color looks against your okay. skin. I do really like this one. Um, I do. I, the shimmer stands out so crazy, but I do think that maybe the color is a little too dark for the beach, but I would love to try well, it yeah, on. yeah, let's try it. You okay. never know. What do you guys think? This one looks a lot like the one that my mom gave you, but just in a different color, in red. Those patterns and everything are very similar, so... Well, that's also one thing that we're going for, that a similar pattern to what your mom bought her, but in the right color. Mm -hmm. So this may do the trick if you're going with that mindset. So let's try what we have so far, and then we'll see how far we get. Okay. Wow. That one is beautiful. Do you like it? What do you think? I love it. It's beautiful. This, I, I, really I love think it so much. Like, this is it. This is a really beautiful dress. I love the color. I love that it's not like a perfect red. It's kind of it's a little a, off red. I feel like it'll go beautifully against the blue of the ocean and the white of the sand. Isabel, what, what do, do you, you think? think? 
It is quite pretty, Deb, but I feel like we can keep looking. I mean, there's just so much more to explore. Why would you know? Why can't we? No, this one. What do you I think? think you really like it? The, but you're yes, here. Let's girl. get this done. You're here. There's so much more. You need to be the bride and shine. Isabel was just like, let's try more on for the sake of trying more on, and I don't agree with it. It's even more disappointing when Neil and Deb both love the outfit. They have, you know, it's a 10 out of 10 for them. So why is Isabel here saying that try more? I'm hoping that it will be something more more bridal, more, more blingy. We're surrounded by these beautiful dresses and I just wanted to see something that was extravagant, something that Deb could come out in and feel really proud. I don't know where she's coming up with that. I think that she might be wrong. Maybe she needs to see the other dresses once more and then she'll realize that the first dress is really the best one. I love the color, I love the embroidery on it. It's just, it's perfect. I, I know that my friend doesn't love it as much, but I'm hoping that I can change her mind. No, I, I, I think we should, This, if you love this one, we should go with this one. She's supposed to be the bride. This is a very special day. She needs something that has just a little more wow, just a little more pop. If she more likes sparkle. this one, then I do let's really call it a day this. and get this done. I think it's worth looking at more. Um, Give it a try. Give it a try. Well, we picked two more. Doesn't hurt to try those and okay. see where we get. I do love the way that it fits, but I'm not a huge fan of all of the animals on here. The zoo? It kind of okay. reminds me of a zoo, yeah. Okay. You know, it is It is very pretty as well. I'm not a fan. It's It's got way too much going on. I can't really see the detail. Well, let's try dress number three. The second dress is very beautiful. It, it, it does seem to have a lot going on, but I think that sort of adds to the story, sort of um, gives her more to talk about. The second dress is not exactly my cup of tea. I just don't think it's really me. I think her friend is confusing her more. I just think that uh, Deb knows what she wants and she'll make the right decision. I do really like this one. The color is really nice. What do you think? I think it's extremely similar to the outfit my mom got for you. What's the point of having two outfits the same, one's just a different color? Do you think she would be a little bit upset because we basically could have worn hers, but then we chose something else? I'm upset. Why would you spend money on this outfit when you have an exact same similar outfit? <laughs> yeah, you're right. As well, what do you think? So maybe, I don't know, it is quite pretty though. It is beautiful on you. I'm not, I'm not a really huge fan because this basically is the same dress in just a different color in red. I could tell that Deb also really likes it too, but I do understand that there might be a little reservation from Neil, but it's still such a beautiful dress. The third dress looks exactly similar to the one my mom had gotten for her. So I just have to trust that Deb will do the right thing and get a at least a different dress. The third dress is beautiful, but I do see my fiance's point that it does look a lot like the one that his mother got for me. And I feel like if she saw it, she would maybe get her feelings hurt just because it is very similar. And it, just because it's a different color, I think it, it may just rub her the wrong way. Can you pull out the first one again? and we can take a look at to that compare and just compare, it. yeah. Okay, I'll bring it out. I think the bride is a little bit confused. I think she's got a little push and pull going on because I know she really enjoys the third dress. Isabel, um, she not, I mean, I don't care that she's not Indian, but I don't think she knows much about Indian clothes. I don't think she knows the, the materials. I don't think she knows what Zerdozi is or the quality of embroidery. I still love this one. I this do one too. is beautiful. So much nicer. I just think it'll be perfect for the beach. I think it's just perfect for my personality. It's understated, but it's not too out there. 
Isabel, I know you were kind of hesitant on this one. True. What do you think? But looking at all of them, having you try all of them on, I think you are right. That one is the most beautiful on you. I think she just needed to see a few more to come back to that one. Definitely. So we all love this first one. I love it. Deb, are you ready to be an Azrana bride? I am. Congratulations. Thank you. You look Congratulations. I know that I already have one for my mother-in-law, but you know, I really feel like this is my dress. She might not be too happy, but in the end, it's Deb who's getting married. So we have to make the best of it and she'll understand. She loves Deb. Everything will be okay. When she came out in the first dress and she had such a big smile, I knew she could try a $10,000 dress and she wouldn't like it. She wanted to get the first one, but her bridesmaid was, you know, pushing her to try other dresses. So I knew in my head that the first dress was the one. 